Okay, I lied. I'm going to do one more comment video um, because I missed this one. And this is from Darkwing X1. And she asked me um, about the Wiccan and Pagans, how not all Pagans are Wiccans and stuff like that. Um, and what exactly defines a Pagan person compared to a Wiccan person. Um, so the thing is, is you can be Wiccan, Pagan, and a witch. Or you could be just one of those. Uh, a witch is someone who does magic. Which is why you can be, so if you do magic, you're a witch. Um, Wiccan is someone who goes by the tenets of Wicca, um, the Wiccan raid, um, the laws, and stuff like that. You can do all of that without being a witch. You cannot do any magic. You could just believe in the religion itself. So you could be Wiccan without being a witch. And you can be a witch without being a wicked. So that kind of explains it. That's a simplistic version. Basically, wicked is anybody who, who goes by the tenets. And you could be a witch and, and not go by any of those tenets, which would make you just a witch. Or you could be a pagan witch. Um, pagans uh, is a little harder to understand. Um, it was originally, the word was used to describe people who lived in rural areas. Um, and so, I mean, pagan is someone who's not necessarily a Wiccan. They don't go by the tenets, but they still worship the earth and stuff. I had a friend that once told me that she would not define me as a Wiccan. She would define me as more pagan. Because I tend to do little things to celebrate the earth all the time. You know, I might, you know, plant a tree and that's my way of worshiping. You know, I mean, little things. Um, I might leave food out for the spirits. And I might not have done a spell or anything. I just leave it out. You know, it's just little stuff. So, pagan's kind of one of those things... Uh, a lot of people that define themselves as pagans, they do the nature worship, but they don't have a basic tenet of Wicca. They they don't necessarily do the Wiccan reign. I describe myself as all three because I I do tend to lean towards the simplistic worshiping of it. I'm not so uh, organized. I, I'm I'm not. Wicca is a little more structured. Than paganism is so I don't know if that helps a little bit um, I don't know if I can find anything on the computer that uh, describes pagans a little bit better uh, uh, pagan it says pagan is an um, umbrella term. Please bear in mind there are a dozen different traditions that fall under the umbrella of paganism. While one group may have a certain practice, not everyone will follow the same criteria. Statements on the site referring to Wiccans and Pagans generally refer to most Pagans and uh, Wiccans. Um, so, it says, let's see. Wicca is, uh, let's see. Uh, basically, pagan came to mean later on people that did not worship God of Abraham, so to basically someone who wasn't Christian. Um, Gerald Gardner uh, brought Wicca to the public, and many contemporary pagans embraced the uh, practice, although Wicca itself was founded by Gardner, he based on old traditions. However, a lot of witches and pagans are perfectly happy to continue practicing their own spiritual path without converting to Wicca. Therefore, pagan is an umbrella term that includes many different spiritual belief systems. Wicca is one of them. So, I mean, that kind of helps, I guess. Um, pagan doesn't necessarily mean you're Wiccan, but you can be. So, Wicca is a sort of, uh, is a pagan religion. It, it's kind of a general term. So, um, 
it's it's kind of a hard thing to do. I describe myself as all three. Um, I usually say I'm pagan if someone doesn't know what pagan means, and I say I'm wicked if they don't know what wicked means. Then I say I'm a witch, and then they usually figure it out. Though then that brings bad connotations, because which is not a very good word in today's language. So thank you, George. Thank you. So that hopefully helps. I guess it's one of those things that is kind of hard to understand. Um. If you really, really want to know, search, do a search engine. It might help you understand better than I could. Um, that's how I've always thought about it. I always thought of pagans as being um, not necessarily under the Wiccan belief system, but they have their own beliefs. Like a pagan could mean someone who is... Uh, more shamanistic. I always kind of thought of them as more pagan than Wiccan. I don't know if that makes sense. But that's my interpretation of it. Your interpretation might be different. So the best I can tell you is read up on the, you know, different types and see what you think about it. So hopefully that helped. If it didn't, I'm sorry. It's one of those hard things to explain. A lot of Wicca is a hard thing to explain. I try and do the best, but sometimes I feel like I fall so short. So if I did, I'm sorry. Try and comment and and, and stuff like that and let me know if I helped you at all. <laughs> okay, that'll be it for this one. I'll see you later. Bye.